Hey there, folks. Welcome back to Cinema Talk. Well, remember a while back when I uh, was talking about the return of Goosebumps? Well, uh, this past uh, couple of days, there actually has been a reveal for the Goosebumps movie trailer, which I thought was all right. You know, it's obviously a film more tailored for a younger person, but it, it's perfectly fine. Um, you know, we got a Jack Black seems to be having a blast playing R.L. Stein. You know, the two, uh, you know, the two or three uh, main characters don't don't seem too annoying. It seems more in the vein of uh, maybe an early Spielberg film kind of a thing that's going on for it. Uh, yeah, you know, we saw a little bit of Slappy, which you know is always a good thing. A uh, bunch of background monsters from the you know from his you know series. Saw Jack Black getting chased by a Wolfman. In a, convenience store, where, or a grocery store, which is pretty funny, um, yeah, I, the, the gnomes seem just hilarious, they may in fact have saved the trailer, uh, um, the two things I, I would have liked to have seen, I would have liked to have heard a little bit of that, um, you know, Goosebumps music, like from the TV show, you know, that do 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 kind of thing, but it didn't bug me that much, um, and I would have liked to have seen a little bit more slappy, and I would have liked to have seen the haunted mask. You know, those are really the two biggest things I always thought of when I thought of Goosebumps, you know? I mean, Arl Stein himself even had a little bit of an introduction during the uh, old uh, TV show for that particular episode for the haunted mask. It wasn't the best introduction, but he cared enough about it to talk about it on a kid's television show. Which is something that normally wouldn't happen, you know. It's kind of interesting. Uh, you know, I'm, I'll be keeping track of this. I mean, you know, I mean, if it, if it, you know, I might go see it in theaters, perhaps. Maybe just save it until, uh, you know, it comes out on DVD. But it's something I'm at least interested in watching. It doesn't look like it's going to completely ruin the series or anything like that. But honestly, in all honesty, the, the series wasn't that serious anyway. You know, it's, it's literally children's horror. You know, they can't show blood. They can't swear. No nudity. You know, they, they do what they can do. And kind of a monster movie, uh, a one big monster movie is a uh, or disaster flick, is a really good direction for this. Well... Like I said, I'll be keeping up with this more and more as I get more about it. Thanks for watching. Bye.